Hey ladies, today I wanted to share with you guys three super fun, beautiful hairstyles using my cashmere clip and extensions. I am wearing here the 20 inch pale ash blonde seamless hair extensions. They are amazing and it's so needed to get these styles where I want them. They give so much volume and so much just added thickness and length to my hair to really be able to accomplish these super fun styles. So for this first style, all you're gonna need are some clear hair elastics and of course your hair extensions. I've got the three tracks in place as well as the two side pieces. And so the first thing I'm doing here is just tying off a small section with that clear elastic. And then the next thing is you'll just kind of grab two pieces from behind where you tied that clear elastic, bring them around to the front and secure them in place. And you're gonna keep doing this all the way down until you like the length that you have. Um, and then once you reach the bottom of where you're wanting your hairstyle to stop, you will start to pull apart the braid. So then you'll just pull apart the pieces. This is really what makes this hairstyle come alive is pulling out the pieces in this kind of uh, very undone braid. And so once you pull those out, make them more voluminous, it gives it this real great bubbly textured look and it's just so pretty. The next hairstyle here that we are going to be doing, all you'll need is a clear hair elastic. This is one of my favorite go-tos of all time. It's also very cute paired with a hair scarf, which I will show you in just a moment. So this is just gonna be a quick half up little bun here. I like to do this a little bit on the messier side so that it doesn't look so perfect. And then you'll just kind of pull apart as you can see here, you know, pulling some pieces around the face to kind of frame the face if that's what you love, which is what I love. So all I'm gonna do here is just pre-tie my hair scarf. This will just make it really easy to secure into place. So once you've kind of pre-tied that, you'll just put it around, pull on the ends, and there you go. Up here we have a side braid. I'm gonna be doing a Dutch braid and it's important to note here that I do have my side piece of cashmere hair extensions already clipped in. This is gonna give me way more volume than I could ever achieve with my natural hair. So to do a Dutch braid, all you do is take the pieces and instead of going over top of one another, you're gonna go underneath of each other. This gives the braid a really texturized, bubbled look rather than a normal braid which is a little bit more seamless and flat to the head this one's going to be really able to pop up once we start pulling out the pieces of the braid so i just kind of add in a little bit of hair as i go and then once i reach about the temple then i stop adding in hair and just continue braiding all the way down i'll just tie it off with a clear hair elastic and then start pulling out the pieces this is one of those that you'll want to pull these pieces out quite a bit run your fingers over it to give it some texture and there you go you've got a gorgeous side braid that you could do in a half up half down style you could wear it just like this you could throw your hair into a bun and it just really elevates any style no matter how you're going to wear your hair so hope you guys love those three hairstyles and i'll see you next time